Diagrams in Google Slides are a great way to show process, cycles, relationships, steps, just about anything you can think of. Start by going to Insert, Diagram. On the right, you'll select the type of diagram you want. Grid just gives you tables. Hierarchy, obviously the flow of something, more like a flow chart. A timeline, process, relationship, and cycle. Let's choose a simple one, such as process. In all of these, you'll notice that there's three items that are showing process. I can change that under steps. So if I only wanted to show three, I could show in this one, I can show three, four, or five different processes or different steps in the process. I can also select my color so that it can fit in a little bit better with the scheme, the color scheme that I've chosen for my infographic. And I can add it by just single clicking on it and it puts it in the document. Before you do this, here's a tip. These diagrams are individual images created to be one thing. So when I click this and add it in, you'll see it laid it on top of what I've already done. And if I want to move it, I can only move one thing at a time. What I would recommend if you choose to use these is to come up here and create a new slide. I'm just going to create a new blank slide and now I'll add it to this slide. This allows me to go in and edit it. Once you have everything typed up and you're ready to use it in your real infographic, again you can select everything right click and choose group. Now it will all be one entity so that you can move it around together. So I'm just going to copy it, click back onto my original infographic and hit paste and now I can move it wherever I want it.